Today we're going to talk about how to create favorite channels on your Savant user interface. You select Settings, Favorites, select the type of source you want to create a favorite for, so cable TV or satellite TV. Now here, the way that I would do it is I would create my categories. And then I hit save, new category, type in news, save, new category, local, save. Once I've done that, and I've created my categories, I'm then going to select all channels, new channel, and we'll say ESPN. We'll select our image for it by touching the image button. Scroll for the image. Select it. Put in your number that pertains to your particular service provider. So, you know, whatever. I don't even know what one is, but 235. Save. And then once you've done that, you can select what category you might want this to come into. So if you don't select a category, when you are in your All Channels filter, it'll show up in alphabetical order. Otherwise, we're going to say, okay, ESPN is a sports channel, so we'll hit Sports. You're going to see a checkbox up here. If you mistakenly hit one of the categories and you want to wipe it out, just touch it again. The checkbox goes away. Save. New channel. We'll say NBC. Find it. We'll say it's channel one, two. If you have a satellite box, it'll probably be like a, uh, the channel number with a dash and then one, which will take you to your high definition version if you're picking it up over the airways. And we're going to put that under, we're going to save it, and we'll put that under locals. We'll do another one. CBS. Eight dash one, save, locals, save again. Save, news, save. And now we've created four presets and we've categorized them. So to see what the result looks like, you can simply go back into, in this case, watch, satellite TV, and then you pull down your favorites. Now this is all the satellite channels, but if we want to filter them, we can say locals, and then there are only your locals up here. Go backwards, you can hit sports, news, and so forth. To get out of your favorites, you just touch the screen anywhere and it goes away. That's it.